Hi everyone, Cheeky Tam here and Corinne. Hi. Now Corinne is my sister visiting from America. Yep, here for a few weeks. Good to be back. Can't you hear her American accent? Yeah. <laughs> Today, thanks to John, we're going to be doing American Taste Test. So let's get started. First, we have to look at this cat calendar because wow. John sent graciously oh, sent nice. me this. Do you yeah. want to show people because they want to see what cats on their mark? Absolutely. You know Isn't how that what everyone does with a calendar? But you want to know what's on yours? Yeah. Because we did it in the last video, but we'll show okay. you again and tell me okay. if you're happy with it. If you're not, you're tough. Oh, I mean. That's Very cute. cute. Have a look at what your All other right. one is. Oh, I got the Russian blue. They're my favorite. <laughs> How can you not love that little face? So the next month we're up to is April. So all you April birthday people get ready. The big calendar. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty standard, isn't it? Standard? <laughs> April birthday people, are you happy with this kitty cat? Or would you prefer this blue-eyed girl? Oh, oh so cute. May. <gasps> This one's good. Oh yeah, that's this very seriously. cute. This one wins. Yeah, wins. I think three kittens beats this little one. But look, that's still <gasps> cute. No, I like that that's one. That's a cute one. I like that one sorry. a lot. We don't need to do June because I already jumped straight to June. Oh, yeah, that wins, sorry. We'll just do July and then that's it. July. I feel like this one might be what? left after the other ones being pigs. <laughs> They're gonna pick this one or this one before this one. You know what I like about that one? I like this one because it looks like it's got an old soul. Aww. What about these ones though? And look at the little grey one. I'm always gonna have the soft spot for the grey one. And do you want to pick what's up first? Yes. My little one loves Halloween. Best day of the year. And she always wants these Swedish fish. Swedish now. fish and friends. And friends. What kind of friends? Oh, it's got some of them on the cover. A turtle and some kind of dolphin. Because these are new. Ready? Ooh, nice colours. How do I do this like that? Yeah. Oh, that one's a turtle. That's pretty cool. Not so many friends as fish, though. Yeah. Oh, hey, hey, all the turtles are green. Oh, there's different flavours. I think I'll try the dolphin. This one. Mmm. Oh, that's nice. This watermelon. No, no, no. Oh, wow. The dolphin is strawberry. So I had that one, that's strawberry, and I said that's watermelon. Turtle is watermelon, and the Swedish fish <laughs> doesn't have a flavour, it's just Swedish fish. I like the dolphin. Mm. I thought we weren't supposed to be eating dolphins. Mm. <laughs> hmm. Mm. Not as good as it hoped. I find that with watermelon flavour, though. I love watermelon. Mm -hmm. Really? Mm -mm. I always feel that watermelon's a bit fake tasting. Oh. As opposed to all the natural <laughs> flavouring in it. <laughs> <laughs> Have you had an actual Swedish fish? Or oh, ages ago. What flavour is it? It's Swedish fish flavour. I don't like those. I just feel like these are a bit of a nothing jelly. Like, I do think we do better juby things like that. What do you call them? Gummies. Chewy gummies. It's pretty good. It's okay. You know what I like about these? Texture? Mm hmm. I like the watermelon fake flavor. Mm -hmm. I love it. Bake, 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 bake. I'll bake, go the it. dolphin. Out of them, I'll go the dolphin. The strawberry dolphin. Which is a shame because dolphins are my favorite animal. And they're delicious. Mm. <laughs> I don't mind these actually. Mm. I would eat them again. Yeah. You wouldn't? Yeah. <laughs> now, Serena loves them. Always sticks them out in the Halloween boxes because they put those little mini packets in the Halloween baskets. Oh. Next up. Yeah. That's where I'm going. Don't you want to say your favorite thing to end? No, because I can't resist it and I have to have it now because uh, I have no. Tam and chips. Mm. Hers and it's white cheddar jalapeno flavor. It. Crisps, chips. Mm. Do you like jalapeno? Mm, I do. But sometimes it's going to be pretty hot. Have a look. Mm. You've had hers chips before? No, I have not. Oh, and you live in America. Yeah. Right? So you come to yeah. Australia to eat American That's snacks. so interesting. I didn't realize. I've never heard of them. Yeah, they're not all around America. Mm -hmm. They're not in all the states. Okay. You have to find out if they're in Connecticut. Okay. Mm, they are hot. Well, they're wow. <laughs> mmm. <laughs> Oh, they're good. I really like them. Mm. Mm. You know what I like? Mm. That cheddar flavour in it. Mm. And then and you've got spicy. That, that heat. Mm. Yeah. These are awesome. I like those a lot. Mm -hmm. I can see us getting into these yeah, later on. Definitely. These are amazing. Yeah. Very spicy though. I like the heat because it kind of slows you down on it. If it was just the cheddar, mm. you just want to keep going. Whereas it's because of the jalapeno, it slows you down a bit. It does. Mm. Really delicious potato chips. Nice amount mm. of salt in them mm -hmm. as well. Love them. 10 out of 10. I'll be looking for these at home now. You know what I'm most not looking forward to out of the whole taste test? I'm sorry, I have to say. What have they done wrong to you? No, blueberry cookie thins made with oats and flaxseed. I might be pleasantly surprised. The sound of flaxseeds for me just mm -hmm. sounds like, I don't know, just sounds, sounds like what? <laughs>
Yom Pecan, roasted and sprinkled with coconut cocoa twist. They look pretty good, actually. I'm actually excited about these. I like anything with coconut flavoring on it. You know so, what I like? What? I like the way you said pecans. You said it with an American accent. Did I? I swear you did. No. I'm going to replay it. Pecan. Say it again. Pecan. Oi! <laughs> no, someone told me today I said something a bit American. Pecans. I did yeah. say pecans. <laughs> Pecan. And this flavor here, it just says yum snacks, pecans, oh, pecans, pecans. <laughs> roasted and thinly glazed. That's all it says. Can you see anything else on there? Do I need to get my glasses? No, that's it. You can tell I'm the oldest sister, can't no. you? <laughs> These are going to be the good ones. Oh, they look good. Wow, look at that. Yum. Yeah. Yum, yum, yum. They look all right. Oh, it's mine. That's yours? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why was that yours? <laughs> I don't know. Mmm. 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 They're pretty good. Really good. Good amount of crunch. Good amount of sugar. Good amount of glaze. Not too sweet. Mm, I like them. You can't really taste the coconut. I'll no, say. it's very, very subtle on mm. it. it. Reminds me of those red peanuts you used to get. You know, mm -hmm. the ones with mm -hmm. the red sugar coconut. Oh, I was inside. addicted to them. I could go into a whole bag of those. Yeah. Justify it with, oh, it's nuts. It's so it's protein. Yeah. <laughs> It's a health treat. We're gonna try these Yom's pecan ones and it just says nothing. It says nothing. crunchy joy. So I better deliver on the joy. Do you like a bit of crunchy joy? Though? I love crunchy food. Yeah. I'm a big crunchy, crunchy, I can't speak. <laughs> big crunchy food fan. Texture is very mm. important mm. with food. Hey, I wonder if I'm taking past you, right? right. Oh. You know this latest thing? I've seen a lot of other fancy taste testers do it, mm -hmm. right? Not me. And they say, oh, I like the mouth feel of it. Ew. Exactly. Oh, thank really? you so much. Yeah. That just conjures up images just... immediately. <laughs> No, 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 no. It's, I'm glad you agree with me mm, on that one. Definitely. Thank you. Good Let us know that. in the comments below. <laughs> mouth feel. How do, you... How do you feel about that? <laughs> Let's have a look at these ones. Oh, I don't know. What about a bird? Maybe they are. Someone forgot about checking on them, I guess. Mm -mm. Yeah, mm -mm. nice. Mm -mm. Boring. The not crunchy joy. And they're not even as crunchy as these ones. I don't have any joy. You might as well just have plain nuts. 100%. Because you're really having sugar on it and you're not tasting it. It's a waste of sugar, sugar. intake. Yeah. <laughs> you got to make your sugar count, really. Mm, you really do. Yeah. <laughs> Tone and everything were like, Hello, you really do. I think we should get the boring one opened up. Well, the one you perceive to All be right, boring. Alright, here we go. Sun kissed cookie thin blueberry made with oats and flax seeds. Artificially flavoured. You know why you don't like the look of this one? The box is very boring. Yeah, I'm not sure about this. Is it a sweet biscuit? Is it a savoury biscuit? Oh, and it's not, they don't call them biscuits. It's a cookie. But that's how they come. That surprises me. I thought, I didn't think they'd be. Ah! <laughs> I didn't think they'd be that little. I thought they'd be about this big. I can smell blueberries. I can smell blueberries too. You ready? Yeah, I'm surprised at how many are on the floor. Uh, are you ready? <laughs> oh, look at them. They're so little. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, they're a lot smaller. This picture on the front here, it makes them look quite big. Oh, it's cute. It's like a little star. Mm. Mm. Come on. They're good. They're better than I expected. And it's definitely a sweet cookie. It's not a, a savory one that you have with cheese and wine. Um, it would also be so good with a cup of tea. Yes. I actually like these quite a lot. And I like the little oh, dried answer. blueberries in them. Mm. It's nice mm. and sweet. They're good. I take it back. I was completely wrong about this. I have to take it back. I really like yeah. them, actually. Sorry, cookies. Sorry, sun, sun gun. <laughs> I'm going to cut that out. <laughs> Sorry, sun kid. <laughs> Together. Is this like sun kiss like the drink? I don't know. I don't know. These are both brands I haven't heard of living over there, so I'm gonna have to check them out. Yeah, really nice. Beverage break! Time for a beverage break, everyone. And today we have a high C flashing fruit punch. Mmm. Low calorie. Mmm. <laughs> Because I'm worried, you know what that means to me? The fake taste. Yeah. Oh, it's zero sugar. Oh, that's gonna be gross. To me, that really like taste afterwards. Eight singles to go. I don't feel good about the sachet of powdered non-sugar sweet drink. I know 
sure about fruit punch though. Why? There's all sorts of fruits in there. You don't know what's in there. And every now mm -hmm. and then you get a hint of it's one. You true. go, could be mango, could be poison. It's always tropical. Yeah, tropical, which is mm. like, mm, that's the fruit we couldn't sell. Yeah. <laughs> We've put it in this. But it might be amazing. It is, it is. We might love it. Oh, five calories per stick. Uh, so there's your sticks there. How mm. exciting. I'm not sure how much right. we're going to add to this to oh, make look, it all look right. At the, look at the instructions. Or do we just have a go and like not add so it all? Easy to make sip from a full bottle of water. No. It says sip from a full bottle of water. Oh, here we go. Pour a stick into a bottle of water <laughs> or a, a large water. glass of water. Shake bottle until or mix well. Until. I haven't got bottle. Oh, what color are you? What I'm not color? gonna put all of it in. I'm gonna put like a little bit in. Oh no, maybe I shouldn't do that. Maybe let's put the water in first and then we'll add the water. Right. Cause you don't know what color it's gonna mm, be, right? Glass. I'll leave that with you. These are good, good time. Oh, we wanna Ooh, do it on Wow. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh. This is what it looks like instantly. <laughs> yeah. Did you put the whole thing in? Oh, the whole thing. You gotta go. The I didn't. Thing. Why not? Whatever's gonna be gross and super strong because I don't like super strong drinks. Cheers. 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 It's got that fake sugar taste afterwards, that aftertaste that you get, that mouthfeel. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't got enough flavor again. <laughs> So I can't really taste the taste that you're tasting. Look, it's not bad, but I just don't know why you would drink that. It's not really healthy, even though it's saying it's high in vitamin C. Oh, sorry, sweetheart. This isn't a health food. No, I know, but that's what it's saying. It's trying yeah. to be. It's drink soda or water. It's pretending to be a fun drink and a healthy drink at the same time. And it's not either. Aren't you having fun? I don't really know about the flavor of this one. As I mm. said, it's a little bit undescript as far as like fruit punch flavor. Yeah. I don't know what. But it's a like very it. accurate color on the box. The thing is, if you were a kid, I think you'd like it. Maybe. Could you imagine being a little... Well, I've got some. Can try them out on it. No. <laughs> <laughs> See, the thing is, Corinne and I are water drinkers as yeah. well. I know, we're very boring. Well, no, we're not... Water, coffee, wine. wine. Yeah, yeah, that's the, the way it All goes. the staples. That one's just okay. So if you don't like to drink your plain water, then you might like that. Yeah. We have two things left. Let's end on these. Oh, okay, because they look scary. We will die from them. <laughs> and we won't finish the taste test. White chocolate peanut M&Ms. Now, I'm a big fan of peanut M&Ms. Oh, they are always my go-to M&Ms. Mm -hmm. I've never had the white chocolate ones, however. Do you like white chocolate? In small doses. It's very, very sweet. All right. What colors are they? Oh, they're the same. They're the same. Oh. So you can't even tell that it's white chocolate, really. Ooh. Oh, sorry. Are you going orange? I don't want the blue one, that's for sure. Mm. All right. Oh! <laughs> Alright. Like not as good as a milk chocolate, but bad. still good. I'd eat them happily. Yeah, I mean it's peanut MMs. Peanut MMs with white chocolate, so all the other yeah, elements are the is, same, but yeah. yeah, these are slightly different tastes. I like them actually. Mm, I do. Yeah. Sweet. Mm. They're a bit sweeter. Mm, yeah. Mm. Yep, thumbs up. We're ending on a doozy. I just said doozy. That's such an old-fashioned word. Yeah. I am an old-fashioned girl, though. You are. These are for a limited time only. They're from Pringles. They're scorching. Is doozy an old-fashioned word? Oh, what a doozy. I say doozy sometimes. Yeah. Not regularly. First we feast presents hot ones. What's first Los we feast? Calien Los Calientes or just Los Calientes? Los Calientes? <laughs> I can't speak Spanish, clearly, but Tamara like, speaks a little bit. And yeah. it says verde, which is green. Yeah, right? I know that one. Oh, yeah. And I know that Caliente is hot. Oh, okay, there you go. He's got flames on his head. That he does have good. flames on his head. Will that be us? Maybe. It doesn't actually pop. It always disappoints me. Ooh. Oh, really? Like... <laughs> I'm actually pretty scared of this one. Mm. Yeah, so, mm. oi, oi. It smells like a jalapeno in there. Oh, look, it's green. <sighs> Mmm. <laughs> yeah, they're really whole. My goodness. <laughs> I don't think I can even eat a whole one. Do it. Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> I can't swallow it. She says that all the time. <laughs> mm. I don't know right now if I want to cry or mm. get in the fetal position. Mm. They're really hot. It says they're scorching. We were warned. Dare to scan. Why are you scanning that, do you reckon? Is that how to recover from these? <laughs> They're hot. You gonna scan it? Should I? Yeah, do it. I'm what scared happens? of it. I'm scared of it. What are we gonna see? Should we show them first? It's not doing anything. Oh, come on. <laughs> Does it not work? Well, I did. Oh, it's there. Dead or, oh, dead or win. I can't win it. Uh, I'll leave here. I can. 
<laughs> but if I've eaten these chips, I want something no, for it. But dare to win what? I don't know. It doesn't say. Because you don't want to win more of those. You definitely don't want to win more of these. Hottest, hottest chips I've ever tasted in my life. I really ever. love hot chips because we love those other ones. Yeah. But this is actually quite. It's painful. My tongue actually yeah. hurts after those yeah. ones. And I'm glad you said let's really have these last because mm. otherwise that would be it. The end, the end of the taste test. Good fun though. Um, Good variety. You can take those home with you if you like. Ooh, no, thanks. no, they're a little bit too hot. But if you are one of those people that, yeah. oh, I can eat anything hot, blah, blah, blah. I'm and like, there are those doing... people that eat chilies. They there just are. eat chilies. So they okay. like them. For chips, for me, chips need to be flavoursome, salty, and I don't want to die. Yeah. I mean, that's it. Pretty much. Thanks, John, though. That was yeah. fun. Thank you so much, John, for sending us all of these things to try. Really do appreciate it. And if everyone in the comments below could please thank John, because without him, this taste test would not be possible. How <laughs> long has it been since we've seen each other? Three and a half years. <sighs> Too long. That was great for Corinne to join us yeah, today. Yeah, it was really fun. Have a fantastic week, everyone. See you next time. Bye. Bye.